Hey everyone, it's Roskill here, and I'm just making this quick video today to address graphical problems that some people are having with this game. Now, it's true, this game is very unoptimized at the moment, but there are some things you can do which will help you with your frame rate, hopefully. It did for me. Uh, so, to start off, I'm using a 1390. Uh, some of you may be using a 20 series card. Some of you may even be using a 10 series card. I don't know how that works out. Uh, I hope your PC is not blowing up on that one. But anyway, so first thing you should do is make sure that dynamic resolution is set to on. And when you have it set to on, the resolution scale here at the bottom, what you want is that to be about halfway. I mean, I have it set a bit higher here, but what you want is preferably around here something like that next what you want to do is frame rate limit you want to set the frame rate limit to 60 I don't see the point in having anything above 60 because this is not an this is not a PvP game this is a co-op game you don't need anything higher than 60 frames you might need higher frames in the multiplayer game a PvP game but this isn't PvP, and it's also unoptimized. So I'd set it at 60 frames a second. I mean, if you want to as well, you can set vertical sync. I don't know whether that'd help or not. Uh, as on a 3090, I'm using mainly high graphic settings. The dynamic resolution was off by default, so but I've turned that on. So high graphic settings with dynamic resolution on and frame rate limit at 60 frames a second and hopefully that should solve your issue unless of course you're using a lower end graphics card in which case set your uh, overall settings to medium or low but I hope this uh, I hope this works for you and I hope it helps and I hope that you're able to play forever winter on something more than 20 frames a second or in my case when I first booted this new version it was two frames a second. It was awful. It was like a slideshow. Anyway, see you later, guys.